Welcome everyone to edit standby mode. First of all, on any screen, if you long press, and we will need to enter in our passcode for this, you can see here, we're able to do customization. So on the first page, you can remove a widget. So we can remove, and uh, we also have the option to add a widget here. And these are any widgets that you would see on your home screen, you can tap, then add like this. And if you want the widgets to auto rotate, you have the smart rotate, which you can turn on or off. And that also works on the right hand side widget panel, as you can see. If you swipe up and down, you can switch between the widgets you see on the first page. And if we swipe, to the left, we now have this photo view, and you can see your photos. Your iPhone must be authenticated with biometrics to see this. And again, we can long press, and you can see the featured photo here, nature, cities, and so these are just categories. And if there is a little icon, you see this icon, you can tap this icon, then you can change, let's say in this case, people, we could change to a different person. Let's say you have you and then, you know, like a friend, you could switch between you and your friends. And if we tap on the plus here, we can use albums. So these are albums that we can see right here. And if I tap on done, we have the time, date, and essentially it will just go through your albums slowly. Um, so you can see it's zooming in and eventually it will switch the picture in your album. And so if we swipe one more time, we have a different clock face here. And uh, we can also swipe up and down to switch the faces and to customize the face. Again, we can long press. And in this case, instead of a people's icon, we have this little circle. And if you tap on the circle here, in this case, we can customize the color. Okay. And you can do this for each face. In this case, there's no customization. Let's have a look at this one. There we go. We can change the color here. And if in the future, you'd be able to add custom faces. There'd be a plus at the top left hand side. If you swipe down from the far right hand side of your screen, we can see the control center. And this is where you could play your music. Uh, keep in mind, you can't change your brightness. Okay, that is locked. On the first page here, which is your widget page, you can tap on the widgets. And then you see this icon, tap that icon. And now we'll open up the application in question. And another thing is the screen will automatically go black on standby mode. However, on some devices, you can change that. So if we go to our home screen quickly, and what you will need to do is you will need to open up the settings. And then you should see here, the standby and you see the always on make sure this one is on but do note that the iPhone 14 Pro series and only future Pro series will have this feature the older devices won't and you can also customize the night mode which if there's low light the screen will go red and that just you know removes the blue light and so yes with that being said if you'd like to help support the channel please do check the description bye bye